Hello everyone. I wanted to tell you a quick story about how I use OnBase every day, illustrating that product evangelists don't just talk about software, we actually use it too. So here at work, my primary software application is Microsoft Outlook. As a product evangelist, I get questions about our products all day long via email. And as an employee of Highland Software, this is also where I complete business or operational activities, which is why I use OnBase's integration for Microsoft Outlook. A year ago, I recorded a presentation about how I use our integration to full text search on base directly from Outlook. And I was able to find the right module reference guide to answer a question I had in my inbox. Well, that was on base 11 and a lot has changed since then. And now with on base 12, we can do even more from Outlook. In fact, the on base functionality available from Outlook has doubled with on base 12. What do I mean by doubled? Well, for starters, just look at the ribbon. And there's so much more. Bringing the way we interact with OnBase from Outlook full circle. Think about what this means for your organization. Think about what this means for you. My story or the solution which I'm about to describe includes three things. Outlook integration, forms, and workflow. So with a focus on forms, let me tell you how I use this. Our story begins in Outlook. This is my inbox, so feast your eyes. Not that of our demo, but my personal inbox. And in here I've got my messages, my folders, my to-do list. I've also got my calendar right here in Outlook. So let's take a look at this week. My son Colin, who's in kindergarten, doesn't have school on Friday. And that's a crazy thing about kids, someone's got to watch them. So I guess I'd better request the day off. And the beauty is that from Outlook, while looking at my calendar, I can submit my time off request. You get that from Outlook, looking at my calendar, I can submit my time off request. There is no better place. I simply click on the on base tab in my Outlook ribbon and select forms. Then I find the form I need to submit right here from Outlook. And yep, I've got a lot of forms, but that's no problem because also new in 12, I can quickly filter the forms list. And then I bring up the time off request form and begin to fill it out. And in this case, the form is a really kick butt e form created by our internal on base team, but this could just as easily be a unity form. My work is done and the request is now in workflow. And now the form is being processed via on base workflow, including timers and load balancing notifications and system work. In this case, workflow sends a notification when user interaction, in this case, my manager's approval is required. But it's not just me. Everyone involved in the process can do their work from Outlook. As my team leader, Tom Vitale receives an email from OnBase workflow signaling the need for approval. And the beauty is that he also never has to leave the message to make the decision. Simply selecting the workflow task button in the email notification brings workflow to the user, including the primary document, related content, and all available ad hoc tasks, allowing users to participate in work workflow processes directly from the message notification itself. And Tom approves the request, and so we remove the workflow task pane from the ribbon, we give him some confirmation, and we stamp that mail message. And now, Tom's work is done, and it's back to me. Finally, I receive an email from OnBase Workflow indicating that my time off request has been approved. And again, because our internal teams here are amazing, I'm able to indicate I'm out of the office directly on my Outlook calendar. By opening up that notification, you can see that we have that calendar item as an attachment. I open it and it marks my calendar that I'm out of the office, bringing us full circle. So that's my experience, Outlook, OnBase, Outlook. Now think about yourself. What forms do you submit? What are you requesting? Think about all of the forms in your organization. Access on base, access those forms from Outlook. Regardless of your role, we're all creating forms. Simply do it from Outlook. So how do you get on base into Outlook? Easy. There's no complex deployment, no client side configuration, Simply click once. Here at Highland, we provide the links to the click once install for Outlook integration on our intranet called Mindshare. Employees simply click the link specific to their version of Outlook, either 2007 or 2010. 
but this type of installing could just as easily be provided via email with a simple set of instructions. But we take it one step further. As a bonus, the workflow notifications themselves, remember that email that Tom received, actually include a link to the install files. This is really cool. I mean, every time I mention this to partners or customers, they love the idea. And finally, if you are already using integration for Microsoft Outlook, if you already have it installed, it can be automatically upgraded to OnBase 12 using ClickOnce, meaning that users don't even have to click again. So not only is the integration packed with features, but it's crazy easy to install and update. So again, OnBase functionality available from Outlook has doubled with OnBase 12, which just means there has never been a better time to start using OnBase integration for Microsoft Outlook. Because form submission with approval is just one scenario. All the OnBase functionality you need is right there in Outlook. All the pillars of the product are there, making Outlook the primary OnBase interface for the majority of the user population. So if there are two things I want, it's one, for you to start using this, and then to talk about it. Why? Because not only will you become more efficient in your organization, but your firsthand experience will make you the best evangelist. Because once you realize the benefits and see how easy it is, you'll be able to help others see the value as well. Customers, partners, and internal employees, heck, even prospects, are invited to join me and other product experts this week at our Best of OTTC webinar series as we talk about doing more with the OnBase Outlook integration. We're even giving a live demo. Of course, for more information on Outlook integration, forms, or workflow, visit the products community at highland.com.